Hello, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ahmad Farid Ananta with the student number of 122-111-223-020. And today I'll be showing you a tutorial on how to use Mendeley. So Mendeley is a reference manager where you can uh, gather up some references and use Mendeley to cite the references onto your documents and also your essays. And that's what I'm going to show you. And for the disclaimer, I'm using Linux system here, uh, specifically Ubuntu, so things are going to be different since I'm going to use the library office because I don't have Microsoft Word here. But it's okay because I'm pretty sure that it works the same way but with the different interface. So let's just start from how you download Mendeley. So in order for you to get Mendeley, you need to go to uh, Mendeley.com right here, the official website for Mendeley, and you can go ahead and use download button here and it will lead you to the installation installation button and stuff like that you can choose the uh, the system that if you you're currently using and stuff like that but if you are a Linux user with library office as you can actually see right over here the uh, Mendeley site is no longer supported for library office so in order for you to do uh, to use Mendeley on library office you use the Mendeley uh, plugin for library office available with Mendeley desktop. So Mendeley desktop is basically the older version of Mendeley. So if you want to get your hands on the uh, older version, you can go ahead and just search Mendeley installers. Here you can um, you can download the older version which uh, will make the plugin for library office to be available. So like that, okay? Now we're going to focus on how to how to use Mendeley. So Mendeley is all about gathering some materials or sources or references as well as starting them onto your documents or essays. Okay. So there are four ways to add some uh, journal articles and stuff like that. Uh, the first one is to add the files yourself. So if you have some files that you want to put into Mendeley, you go ahead and choose add and then add files and you choose the files that you want to uh, upload to Mendeley like that and it will automatically uh, it's automatically filled like that with the metadata stuff like that mate and then the second way is to use the uh, Mendeley website itself so let me go over to Mendeley right here and I'm going to sign in and I'm going to uh, search for some journal and add them to my library. Okay, so be back in a minute. Here we are. I'm already logged into my account and this is going to be what it looks like on the website. And fun fact, the newer version will actually look like this. It's basically, the newer version is basically uh, the website itself, you know. The interface is basically like the website itself. So in order for you to search for uh, references or something like that, you go ahead to Mendeley search right here search Mendeley and then you just basically search for articles okay so let's let's try fetishism and it will automatically appear right here and you can choose whether or not you want to uh, use the most relevant the most reason and the most and the most cited cite it right over here so like that and then uh, make sure that you actually pay attention to the, uh, the abstract here and make sure that it's actually something that you are looking for and then you if you if it seems right and stuff like that you go ahead and add to library and it will automatically uh, it will automatically be added to your library something like that that's the second method okay so the third one is to use the uh, what is it actually called again the uh, manual manually yeah the third one is to add them manually so if you see the add right here click it and then there's going to be this add entry manually so it's basically like you filling out some information about uh, the things that you want to uh, the file that you are referring to and stuff like that it's basically the same as the references the enter citation on microsoft Word, something like that and i'm not going to do that to uh, save some time and lastly we use what's called the uh, mendeley site right here mendeley oh sorry Mendeley Web Importer. So if you have some kind of like a uh, a website that you want to cite from, you go ahead. Like for example, I want to have some um, search about, say, Cusco flag. Cusco flag, something like that. 
and if you want to select the uh, website and something like that you go ahead and click on this one right here and then you can actually choose this and add it to your library that's the fourth one the fourth method all right now it's the real deal the signing so I got this document right here where I implement the signing as well as the bibliography so for library office the Mendeley tools will be shown right over here we got the insert citation and you edit blah 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 bibliography citation style export MS Word compatible stuff like that and then yeah so how do we insert the citation well simply we just choose the insert citation right over here let me just okay insert citation right over here and then it will show you the prompt right here where you can search for the documents that you have on your library so here I'm going to uh, search cyberpunk cyberpunk cyberculture right here just basically click it and then click OK or maybe if you want to modify stuff you can actually just click on the the thing <laughs> yeah and then you can specify which right which page that you take the information from and stuff like that okay so let's just click OK and then it will be auto what so the citation will automatically appear like that mate that's how simple it is mate and I'm going to do the same thing for the other sources or citing stuff like that and then we just want to implement the same thing as well so yeah All right, so I've already implemented all of the required citation, like this one right here, this one, and then this one right here. And now we're going to focus on a bibliography. So let me just create a section for the bibliography. Let me just uh, create a heading and then name it bibliography. There you go. And then in order for you to insert the bibliography, you just simply click on the insert bibliography here. And I'm pretty sure that it's going to be different in Microsoft Office uh, to, to its interface so I just click on it and voila it's automatically appeared like that based on the citation that you put into the document it's just like that and it's actually how simple it is to use Mendeley so that's actually all for the tutorial on Mendeley and yeah as you can already tell that it's a it's something useful especially when you are doing some research on certain things to just simply use Mendeley for references and also for sign okay so that's it for the video uh, thank you for watching and then I'll see you again later if there's going to be any more assignment next week so yeah goodbye then